Uh, we're here at Warburg's head cross country coach Ryan Chapman. Uh, we just came off the John Kurt Invitational. Both the men and women's team uh, perfect scored. Um, what's your overall reflections on that day? Yeah, we had a good day. Um, it was exciting to get the whole team back together at home. You know, our, our first meet, we sat out 13 guys. We sat out, you know, just about 10 girls. So it was fun to get most of the crew running again. Uh, it was only a 5K uh, for both the men and women. And we really like to, to treat these 5Ks sort of as, you know, as practice races for the longer distances. And you know, we want the women to start thinking 6K. We want the men to start thinking 8K. You know, what are the takeaways? Our girls are, they're really good. You know, we have really high goals this year. We want to do something special. And uh, if we're going to do that, you know, we need to make sure those packs are sticking together um, through the entire race, or at least until the last, you know, four or 500 meters. So that being said, um, the women had a great day. I mean, Karina wins the race a, a minute faster than she won last year. Uh, Aubrey Fisher is just on a tear. I mean, she ran faster than Karina did last year. Karina finished 15th in the nation. Uh, I'm not talking transit property runners, but could Aubrey Fisher be an All-American? I think so. Behind her, All-American Cassidy Christopher. You know, our, our top five is running fantastic right now. Riley Mayer's you know, running out of this world. Um, Janelle Baskins is, you know, is looking fantastic. You know, we have so much depth on our women's team. So yes, we need to tighten those packs, but there's still a lot of things that we can be excited about at this point in the season. Guy side, you know, we're we're highly ranked for a reason. You know, we have a lot of depth. Um, we just need to tighten our packs. Our top finisher, Joe Freiberger, um, runs 1520 or something like that. Um, our uh, our next finisher, uh, Alec, uh, you know, just looking fantastic. You know, this year uh, we're hoping that he can. Uh, you know, he can close the gap and bring a lot of guys with him. Christopher, a uh, freshman, you know, coming in, looked great, you know, two meets in a row. You know, so we know we got the guys, uh, put it that way. Uh, we just haven't executed yet, so we're hoping at Bradley we can keep tightening those screws, both on the men's and women's side.